Hello friends, welcome to another software webcast and in today's video we are going to see how to create a hidden network share in Windows Server 2012 R2. If you are on a computer network and are sharing folders between users, you can add extra bit of security by making a share folder hidden with your workgroup or domain Windows environment. Of course this doesn't 100% means that somebody won't be able to access it so it's best utilized with other security measures. Hidden share are useful if you want to share a folder but only want it accessed by people who you have given the share name to. A hidden share is a share folder that administrator creates on any Windows operating system. The difference between a normal share folder and a hidden share folder is that the share folder that is hidden is not visible to the user who access the file server or the computer on which the hidden share folder resides. Even if network users use UNC path to the target computer, the folder that is shared as hidden is not visible. The only way to access the hidden share folder is to type the exit UNC path to the folder itself. A share folder can be made hidden by specifying a share name to the folder followed by the dollar key. If share name does not contain dollar, it is shared normally and is visible to everyone who use the UNC path to access the target. So for this purpose of this demonstration, as you can see, we are using Microsoft Windows Server 2012 R2 Data Center Evolution Edition and this is our domain controller. On other computer, we have a Windows 10 Enterprise Evolution Edition and this computer is a part of our domain. So let's create a hidden share folder on our domain controller. Let's click on a file and storage services, then click on a shares. And now click on a task and select new share. Select SMB share quick profile and then click on next. Now here, let's specify the custom path. And for this demonstration, let's create a folder on our C drive. C colon slash share one. Click on next. And this is the our shared name. Share one. Now a share folder can be made hidden by specifying the share name to the folder followed by the dollar key. Means if you put a dollar symbol at the end of the share name, and that share will be created as a hidden share. If a share name does not contain a dollar at the end of the share name, it is shared normally and is visible to everyone who uses the UNC path to access the target computer. Now this is the, our local path to the folder c colon slash share one and this is the remote path of our shared folder UNC path srtfndc01 slash share one dollar. Click on next. It will give you a one warning message that the local path you entered does not exist. Click on ok to create this directory or click on cancel to select the different local path. Click on ok to create the folder. Now here we don't want to select anything and for this demonstration I'm not going to modify the permission just click on next and click on create to create the hidden share folder and as you can see the share was successfully created and this is the our share folder name share one. You should note that you can only create this hidden share when you first share the folder in Windows operating system. For some reason you can't change the share name once you have shared the folder so in order to change it you have to first remove the share and then you have to reshare the folder and then you are able to create a hidden share. Let's swing back on our client computer and how we can access the hidden share folder. Now if we access the UNC path of our server and that is UNC path SRTF1DC01. Now here we can only see the two folders named netlogon and syswall. But on a server, actually we have a three share folder. As you can see, share one is not displaying over here. Now suppose if we want to give access to user to a hidden share, that time we have to tell the name of our share folder to the user. Now suppose if user want to access the hidden share, that time user have to specify the path of share folder itself. Now in our case, it will be a UNC path SRT-DC01 slash share one and at the end of share name we have to put a dollar sign and then hit enter and this time user is able to see the share folder now let's put a one file under our share folder on c drive share one and let's create a one simple file okay and if you check on our client computer here we can see a simple file is there so this is the way how you can create a hidden share on a windows server and this is the way how user can access a hidden share from client computer. That's it for this video demonstration. Thanks for watching this video.